Alright, hi guys, <clears throat> good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, good midnight, depending on where you're watching this video. My name is Kuziat, aka the best smartphone designer. Um, it's the first time you come to my channel. Please and please kindly hit the subscribe button. Hit it hard, like hit it now now. Even though it's time, no go start class. So oh yeah, it time, hit it now now. So we can get started. So in this in today's tutorial, this is what we'll be creating in today's challenge. Um, today will be the day seven challenge, right? So we'll be creating this design here. All right, I'll show you how we can create all this thing from scratch. So that's just it. Um, let me just open another page. So I've put all the resources that we need for the design. I'll put it here. Then I've placed this one here. So let us get started. So the first thing is that we'll just take our background here. Let me copy it, then put the background here. So yeah, when you take it from your gallery, I hope you get. So let's place it here. So the next thing after we take this stuff now is to do what? Let's come to our more here. I hope I show you how to what make everything set as what as background. Then to take the size. Can you see that? So as simple as that. So what's the next thing? Let me put these two logo here. So these two logo. These are the these two logo. So I'll be sending you all your resources to you. I'll be sending you everything. Check the description link below. You'll be getting the um the resources link there. So that's just it. And as for you that you know in my Canvas Second Masterclass, in case you want to join my Canvas Second Masterclass, so I'll be sending you a link to get the course whereby to take it to my DM and you can take it up from there. So it's not expensive, but it's very affordable. <laughs> So um, let me reduce this a little bit, then place it like this. All right, all right. So just put this one this way. Make sure that the size from year to year is empty from the size from year to year. So always be conscious of your spacing. I hope you get. Always be conscious of your spacing. All right. So let me just leave it like this. I don't want to waste too much time in this tutorial. Then the next thing to do is that what it is another. I'm really sorry for talking this way. I'm not really feeling fine, so I'm having. I think I'm having malaria, so I'm not really strong like that. So just take me the way I am. And I'll be liking you guys to tell me what will you guys love me to create in the next tutorial by tomorrow. So just say it in the comment section say it in the comment section what this is what you want us to create this flyer maybe you have a having problem to design flyer like this just let me know on the comment section that what this is what you want me to create in the next in the next tutorial so all right the next thing is now let me just take this stuff here how did i do that come to your element here so after going to your elements you click on shapes pick pick this shape so after picking this shape, take it here like this, then take this one this way, enlarge it. So come to your color, then you pick your golden yellow. So this is the color we use, golden yellow. All right. So this is. It. Then the next thing I just adjust this off. Wait. Okay. Adjust this a little bit. So as you can see that in this side this one is smooth this one is straight and here is curved how will you do that just duplicate this one make it two after you duplicate it like this then you can now um <coughs> so after you duplicate you can now do like this come to your style here uh, i say style your corners here then increase the corner rounding can you see? Can you see? So, if it's the first time you are coming to my to my channel, kindly click the subscribe button. We are click it now, now. Click it. Click it. We are click. So you can continue. Click the subscribe button now, now. And what? Share and what? Like this one. Like the video. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, it's curved now. So you now group these two together. Come to your more. Click on select multiple. They click on this one below here. So both of them have what you have copied both of them like that. Click on group. So you have now grouped them together. I hope you get. 
So the next thing that I would do type there, it is another. Come to your text side, then click on this add a sub heading, then type your it is another. So the font we use is what is Marcellus font. Come to your font here, then click on this upper side, then click on your what Montserrat. Then you take Montserrat board. I hope you get all right. So let me see. Okay, then just increase it a little bit, then place it here, then reduce this. Make it fall like this. So change the color to what to black, you know. Change the color to black so it will be more visible. If you leave it in white color, it will not be visible. Uh -huh. So I can just place it like this. Uh, as you can see the letters are closer to each other so I uh, you come to this place your la your spacing here then you reduce the line sp letter spacing I hope you can see all right so make it four at the center of these two so make it for the center so make it for the center so after that, Click on this stuff, click on this, click on this. So group everything together. So make sure that this stuff fall at the center of the page. Come to your position here. Then click on align. Then click center here. All you can see. So that's just for that. So the next thing to do is that what? Monday. So you come to your Montserrat font too. Then you type your more. Mon. Let's do this one like this. So please, please, and please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, um, can you subscribe to this channel so it will help others to able to see it and like and give a comment and give a comment to let me know what design you want me to do next. Please give a comment to the comment section now to let me know what design we want us to do next. So, Mon. So the font we use. These are Montserrat fonts. So we are using Montserrat black. So click on this upside. Then you take your Montserrat. So we are using Montserrat black. So it should be very thicker. So in this place now, I want us to come to our format here. Format here. Make this in standard this, as this side. Align to the left. So I don't want it to be dragging up and down. Uh -huh, make it bigger. As you can see so okay start from this side Monday so make the line spacing come to your spacing reduce the line spacing aha uh -huh. they make it start from this side make this start from here aha uh -huh. And very soon, to remind you guys, I'll be doing a logo course. I'll be teaching you guys how to create logo very soon. So the course is coming up very soon. So just be aware. I'm just giving an update. Keep anticipating on how you can be doing logo. You'll be able to create different kinds of logo by yourself from scratch and using 3D logo as well. Just uh, stay tuned, Sha. When it comes out, I will allow you guys to know. So the next thing to do now, this is Monday. So um, this one comes outside. I would like to do it this way. I would like you to follow this simple, simple here. Then the day should also proper align. When I was designing this, I didn't follow protocol here. If you look at my design, the end comes outside of this side. So I won't do this one in this place. I want everything to be properly done here. So Monday. So the day should be like this. What do they do this one like this? Uh -huh. So let me uh, increase this stuff so that it will blend with this side. So drag this one. Uh-huh. So take this one down a little bit. I hope you see. Take it down a little bit. Monday. Alright. 
So what is the next thing to do? Our clock are here. So before putting our clock, let me put this down stuff here. So to put the down stuff, let me just take it from this side. Or let me just go to my shape itself, the element side. So you pick your shape. And I want to show you something this shape side. In case you pick shape and for instance, you don't want to use the same shape again. You can just come to shape here. This down part, you can see how that shape. When you click on it, it will change. Can you see? And click on the circle to change the circle click on this way to change can you see so for you not to be going back to that same place again so that's just for that so let me take this one then drag this one here oh what did they do so far now let me delete this all right so this is the next thing to do here take this one so the next thing I should put this up more here so I will duplicate this then put this so make sure it falls at the center as you can see here something make it pop up I put a shadow there so I get our shadow you come to your element side so if you don't put shadow it will not show that way so click on your search then type black shadow black shadow so search for black shadow oh uh, okay let me see let me make it clear let me make the statement clear black let me be specific square shadow all right last square shadow fine amazing so let me take this one let me take this one. You can find a new one that you can use. So, in case you are using pool, you are using now free. Since it's free, you can use this one. Any one, I hope you get. So, just take one. Let me take. I don't want to use this one. So, I want to use this. This. So, when I just take this one, take this, reduce it. Reduce it, Abby. Then make it go back of this stuff here of this one so you come here jog it like this aha uh -huh, i hope you get so it's not too much the shadow is not too much what you do come to your transparency you reduce it a little bit reduce it uh, hey, so you just be faint okay you see that what this side is not taking this side so duplicate the shadow if it's not taking it duplicate it then put it like this put it like this so then send it to the back come to your position then click backward once i hope you see so it has pushed this stuff up for us all we can see so it's not making sense before when there's no shadow there you cannot see the reflection so now the next thing to do that was type this stuff man the type i will just copy it from this side then paste it there paste it here so then let me just increase this a little bit. All right, can you see? So make sure it's for the center. Aha, uh -huh. you are. You are. So the next thing to do is that new week, new blessings. So may I'll just carry on this one. I won't type it. You will type it. So the Montserrat I use is Montserrat Medium. Montserrat medium i hope you get montserrat medium so put it here and paste it here and group this so i think my this my shape is not balanced if you look at it the space from here to here here is smaller than the space from here to here so my rectangle must be properly centered at the center so click on it let me click on it and make sure that it's centralized because you have to work with alignment when designing so come to your position you click on align here then click on center aha uh -huh. you see now it's not centralized now can you see aha uh -huh. so let me shift my shadow that is there a little bit a little bit all right then shift this one to so far the center aha uh -huh. Your wow. 
I hope you see if you are finding value in this my tutorial please kindly like this video and click the subscribe button if you have not subscribed to my channel please it will mean a lot to me click the subscribe button click it add so um and tell me in the comment section that what what you want me to do next in the next tutorial what are the things that you need maybe you don't know just tell me in the comment section then i will check for the one that is what very good and maybe that will be our next tutorial challenge so just tell me in the comment section so the next thing to do is that well, let us take my clock this is my clock i downloaded from subway so i copy this side initially it's like this can you see it's like this and it's there so i copy it so let me just copy do i already use resources check the resources in um, the description link below you will see the resources there so as i don't copy now i will paste them for you i hope so you get so Make sure for the center, then send it to the back of this one. Can you see? So I send it to the back. So this is just it. So this is just it. Then just take this one. Make sure it's well done. Then let me take this one down a little bit. So it will come down a little bit. Um, let me take this one first. Then take with this. All right. All right. So this is just for this now. Let me do this. All right. So the next thing to now do is that we'll let's put this all this corner stuff, all this blue stuff here. So this is it here. Then I'll be sending it to you, don't worry. <coughs> so the next thing is to take this and paste it here. Then duplicate it. Put some here like this. Rotate it. Just do it the way you like. It's just to fashion it to give it under stuff aha uh -huh. so this is just for this all right so the next thing is that what let's put our phone number uh, the phone number and everything there So, all right, copy this. Just want to copy it, but you type it too. Uh -huh. I already, already know how to type now, so I uh -huh. cannot distress myself. All right, so this is the end of our design. We are done with our design. We are done with our design. So, once if you find value in this tutorial, kindly click the subscribe button like this video and share it so that it will reach other people um so this will really mean a lot to me so this is about 18 minutes um and those if you want to join my master class you want to get my course i have a full course of graphic design in my master class which is canvas master class so i'll be dropping a link below that will take you to my dm then we can take it up from there it is not expensive but it's very affordable so that's just it uh, we we'll meet in the next tutorial. Let me know in the comment section what design you want me to do next. Let me know in the comment section. So that's just it. We we'll meet again. Bye. I make cozy Don't forget. <laughs>